and welcome to Marsha's Mush and Stuff. And if you're new here today, thank you so much for clicking on this video. I definitely appreciate each and every one of you. And if you have not yet subscribed and you love everything Dollar Tree, Dollar General, hauls, shop with me, walkthroughs, DIYs, and so much more reviews, then this is definitely the channel for you. And if you've not subscribed, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button ring the bell for notifications, and give a thumbs up. It definitely helps support the channel and it continue to grow. And also, YouTube to notice me just a tad bit more. With all that being said, I do have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. It is a collective haul of several different trips, but also from yesterday's trip. So, wanted to get it out there to you. So, I hope that you can find these items in your store as well. Some of them you may have already seen, and some are brand new, you guys. So, stay tuned. But let's get started and see what I did pick up. I did a shop with me, and you can go back and watch that. You will see it first. I try to share that first before I do the haul so you can see everything, because obviously I don't pick up everything that I see. <laughs> I wish I could, but I don't. With that being said, I did find the Garnier Aqua Boost face mask. Now, it does say you mix it yourself. So, it has the dotted lines on the back. And you can see that right there to where you fold this in half and then you mix it. It gives the directions on the back. But the sheet is up here, the sheet mask. And the essence is down here. So, how cool is that? Super impressed to find Garnier at the Dollar Tree for a dollar, especially the face mask. I have seen the dry shampoo, but have not seen the sheet mask before. So, super excited to give this a try and see how it works, and I will let you know in a review my thoughts. So, there is that one. Then just kind of grabbing at random as I always do no particular order ever <laughs> so this is the sassy and chic cuticle oil and nail strengthener so hope you can see that there but you guys I I need some help with my nails so I definitely wanted to pick this up my cuticles get very dry so and my friend Zaina actually hauled this from OK at Home DIY, so if you have not checked her out, I'll link her in the des description box as well. So it was because of her that I picked this up. I was like, oh, that is super cool. It's 0.45 fluid ounces. So there is that. And again, like I said, it's just cuticle oil and nail strengthener. So if you see this, I, I would definitely grab it. It's worth a dollar and worth giving a try. Again, I will do a review and let you know my thoughts on it. Also grabbed these felt letters, a hundred of them, guys. Every time I see these, I try to grab at least one pack. They're hard for me to find, and with that being said, that's why I picked these guys up. So again, felt letters, a hundred pieces. And they do come in different colors, but I chose black, and you can paint over them as well. But thinking farmhouse DIYs, black would come in super handy with the black and white buffalo check. So I also ran across another one of these plant hangers in the tan color. I have two in the black, and they're macrame, and they are just plant hangers. And again, I know we've seen these before, but it's been sitting in a bag waiting to be shared with you, my friend. So I hope, again, that you can find these. It has the little, like, jump ring to hang it from. And then there it is. Super cute, super excited to find these. And I just kept seeing them and decided it wouldn't hurt to have a tan one. So there, bow to the brow. So you see that there. And again, by Wet n Wild. And I do believe uh, it says 
let's see what easy to apply brow mascara so it is for your eyebrows not your eyelashes so we'll let you know what I think of this in a review because my eyebrows are getting quite thin on the ends if you can tell it kind of looks like I cut them off but no nope, they're just getting thinner so with that being said I will let you know what I think in a review and that will be upcoming pretty soon because I have a lot of cool things to review for you guys and then I just ran across a, this cute adorable tie-dye notebook yesterday imported by Greenbrier it's just a notebook a lined sheet notebook but love it and thought my daughter would absolutely love this and her birthday is coming up super soon so wanted to grab this for her so that she can journal so that's why I grabbed this one and I also had picked this up quite a few a couple weeks ago the deep pore charcoal facial cleanser draws out dirt and oil compared to the Bior charcoal cleanser and it is four fluid ounces so you see that there and again it's the charcoal facial cleanser super excited to try this out and again I'll let you know what I think of it if you've used this, drop me a comment. Let me know how you feel about it. And I hope I'm saying the Bior correctly, but I do believe that's how you pronounce it. If I'm wrong, correct me below. And then I also found the Snuggadoo socks, socks <laughs> in the Easter print. How cool are those? Was thinking of a gnome when I picked these up. But they do have the grippers on the bottom, so you could use it for that. I do apologize. My cat and my dog are playing in the background, so you're hearing them right now as we speak. But here are these Snuggadoo socks. <laughs> They're cracking me up. They're literally chasing one another right now. And if you have not seen Life with Mike, definitely check him out. He just featured my cat Pickles on his Kitty's Corner. So I'll link that video below in the, in the description box if you missed out on that. So cute, so hilarious, super funny, and I love watching Life with Mike. So again, I'll link him below if you have not seen him. So just moving right along, because I do have a basket full of goodies for you guys. Found this yesterday in the mesh tube. And you do get 36 feet of it in Easter colors. And they had so many different colors, you guys. But I just went with the white and the blue. My thoughts were you could use this anytime. And it is iridescent. So it kind of has like a purple pink to it as well. But you can pop these in wreaths and really jowls it up, you guys. You really can. So with that being said, that is why I picked these up. Have never used the mesh tube before, but I am going to make a mesh wreath. So that's why I grabbed these. These fairy lights. I actually grabbed four packs. So there they are. And I've showed you in a walkthrough, and I'm sure you've seen them in your store recently picked up of these. I have been looking for these for quite some time and now that Crafter Square is growing, it is a snake. It really is a snake. It would make a cool toy, but it is in the Crafter Square aisle. I have seen people craft with these and make handles or a wreath. I mean, so much you could do. Of course, you'd have to chop off the snake's head to do that, but how cute are these guys? Again, I had been looking for quite some time and now I see them everywhere all the time. So hope you can find these in your store, especially if you craft. It does say, you know, wood animal. Then, like I said, handles. Yes, handles. How cool would that be on a DIY? So that was my thought. Also, my friend Zana from OK at Home DIY recently 
haul these as well. And again, I'll link her in the description box. But these are the big brush set, two piece. So you get one big, one small. These are great to craft with. So if you have not seen these or have not picked them up and you love to craft, I would highly recommend that you grab these. They work really well. And the bristles don't get stiff like some of the other ones do. Also grab the felt letters. Wait, the felt letters, you do get a hundred piece. And these are kind of hard for me to find. I see the numbers all the time, but not the letters. So wanted to grab the felt letters when I saw them. And they do come in different colors. So grab the black, thinking farmhouse, black and white theme. You get the idea. So there are those. Also just grabbed this yesterday, actually. And this is by Spa Life Beauty Trip Facial Mask Merlot Plus Antioxidants. It contains three facial masks for a net weight of 2.43 ounces so hope that you can see that there like I said it has three sheet masks in it and super excited to try this one out I had been wanting to pick this one up and just kept passing it saw it again and thought nope I want that I want to try it out and have things that you know I can also review for you guys and anything I can do to stay younger and healthier looking I am all about that so it had me at antioxidants so there is that one and then I also ran across these Crayola washable take note felt tip pens by Crayola and they do come in several different colors, but they are washable, smooth lines, vibrant colors, and felt tip. So, there you see on the back. Just thought these would be great to have. And Crayola, again, at the Dollar Tree, super impressed. And it does say vivid colors and solid lines at the top. So, if you see these, Definitely a score. Crayola is a name brand, as we all know. And then, you guys, super excited to run across these. I've seen other people haul them, but I have never found them. They are Maddie's Masterpiece UV Light Reveals Invisible Ink. So, it's a secret message pen. So, there's that. So, it literally writes invisible and then you press this button and light it up to reveal the secret message how stinking cool is that i love that and it does say for ages six plus so my grandson may actually end up with this but i will do a review for you guys and show you how well it worked and let you know we'll do that together my grandson and I. So, yeah, because this will probably go to him for his birthday. And also, okay, so I also grabbed these cutie pies. They are the felt sticker six piece in the egg shape. And I think they match quite well with the Snugadoo socks. So that's where I was getting the Easter gnome from. Well, I just kind of thought of it when I saw it, but again, does it not match these prints right here? These are so super cute and great for DIYs, especially if you craft. So if you see these, grab them when you see them. Don't think about it because they won't be there when you go back, just like the beautiful garland that I skipped over and wish now that I had grabbed it. Guess it wasn't meant to be. <laughs> also got these adorable felt stickers eight piece set the boy and girl bunny rabbits the boys kind of hiding back here but you see them there and again eight piece set so these are too cute as well and then oh my goodness so many stickers 
the Puppy Stickers 9-piece set. It's all about you, love, take your time, and always in my heart, and so many other words. But these are so cute, you guys. I love them. The sticker section gets me every time. If you love the stickers, let me know in the comments below because, again, it just gets me every time I pass through there. So sorry, they are wild this morning. So, by Crafter Square, the rub on transfers, the foil rub on transfers, that is, and you have the entire alphabet here. So, how cool are those? And these are great to use if you don't have a Cricut. They work just the same, you guys. And it shows you how to use them on the back. And I picked up that font. And then I also grabbed the skinny font that looks to me more like a Ray Dunn font, if you will. But absolutely love these. How beautiful are those? And again, they are the foil rub-on transfers as well in Crafter Square. So check and look for the rub-on transfers. Again, if you don't own a Cricut, they work just the same, you guys. So definitely, if you see them and you like doing DIYs and crafts, definitely pick them up. And some of these are dupes that I did want to share with friends. So, these are rub-on transfers as well. And, um, again, it's just a different font, but you see that there. And these are in black, and they don't say foil. These just say craft. But they, these are super cute as well, you guys. So, definitely look for the rub-on transfers. I know I'm going to sound like a broken record, but, again, they work just like a Cricut does. So... Again, more rub-on transfers in the foil, but again, in the skinny font. And those are so pretty. I absolutely love these. Grab two of those. Like I said, probably one to send out in friend mail or something like that, or to give to a friend. Same thing. <laughs> and then grab these rub-on transfers. I think they're the same, are they? Let's see. Nope, they're not. They're different. These are a bit different. No, they're not. They are the same. So I actually grabbed three of these. So there's that one and that one. Yeah, they are absolutely the exact same. Don't know why I grabbed three, but I did. Maybe I grabbed two for myself and one for a friend. And then this nine-piece sticker set, 3D Motion is what it says. But look at that stunning clock, you guys. How pretty is that, this one? And again, they are the puppy stickers. I just absolutely love these. And again, the sticker section truly got me on this day, apparently. And then just a couple more stickers. Love this one, the rub-on transfers with the words. You have so many words. Happiness, embrace, grace, kindness, adventure, welcome, love you, discover. Just so many words that you can use. And again, they are the rub-on transfers. And if you don't know how to do them, they explain exactly how to on the back. So how cute are those? And you get so many words. So those are too cool. And then I grabbed this stencil. And like this cursive or calligraphy style, if you will. But too cute. And again, if I can upcycle and not have to buy brand new and just keep reusing, I am definitely all about that. So that is why I grabbed these. So they are those, and again, they are stencils, not stickers, like I once said. And, oh, and I did get two of the ones with words. 
And then yesterday, I found by Broadway this bamboo facial sheet mask. No paraben, no artificial colors. Pore minimizing, dermatologists test it. Uh, charcoal draws out impurities and renews skin. Inspired by K Beauty. And it is 0 0.67 fluid ounces. So how cool is that? It says charcoal mask helps flush out environmental toxins, dirt, and debris that helps, or that helps, that can clog pores and cause skin to look dull, leaving the com complexion clarified, refreshed, and healthier looking. And I will let you know in a review. Also, skipped this the first time, so was super excited to find it the second time for my daughter to put on her dishwasher. Check this out. It's a double-sided magnet. I do believe it's by Jot. Maybe not. But it is a double-sided magnet, you guys, and it says clean on one side, and then on the other side, it says dirty how cool is that to stick on the dishwasher and that is exactly why I grabbed it so instead of having to ask my daughter every time are these clean are they dirty she can pop this on and turn it around so that is so cool I absolutely love this and like I said skipped it the first time saw it the second time and said nope it's meant for me to get Get to give to her super excited about that and then I know they come out with these every year but first time I'm seeing these in my location so I found the I think it's pronounced micellar water cleansing water so it cleanses and hydrates your skin all in one no rinsing no alcohol no residue Gently removes makeup and impurities, all skin types, e even sensitive skin. So if you see these, definitely grab them. I've heard great things about this, and I do believe my friend Marina from Confessions of a Dollar Tree Addict um, hauled these, I think, last year. But she had great things to say, and I will let you know in a review as well on those my thoughts on those passed on this the first time saw it again and was like that would make a really cute DIY using these and they are wood you guys it's a wood cutlery set so how cool is that and you get the forks knives and spoons and it is a 12 piece set super stinking cute and like I said, I passed it the first time, saw it again, and said, nope, I meant to have at least one pack of them. At first, I couldn't think of what I would use it for, and then quickly decided a DIY. That would be so cute. So, I probably will not leave them with the pineapples, even though they're ever so cute the way they are. You could also eat with these. So much that you can do with these, you guys. So there are those. And then my Dollar Tree receipt from yesterday. So obviously I was a good girl. Grabbed one of these little gold baskets. I know we see these a lot. And this is the essentials. And it is by Dollar Tree. Imported by Greenbrier. But love these. And so much DIY potential with these. So, I'm going to make something pretty cool with this. More of the wooden letters. And I believe these are a little bit bigger. No, they're not. They're a 26-piece set. They look bigger to me, but they're not. But again, when I see the wooden letters, I definitely pick them up because they are hard for me to find. Also grab this big bucket. It is in the primary color blue, but that is perfect because my grandson's birthday is coming up and it does have the handles. So I will use this 
for his birthday basket instead of a bag so that he can put his toys in here or he can use it for whatever or maybe even mom will decide she wants to use it for something else so there is that one I think it's better than a bag because it's reusable I mean you can just keep using it so and it's pretty deep as you see here and pretty big let me hold it back here because I know sometimes when we show it on camera it looks bigger than it actually is but this is a pretty big bucket you guys so there's that one and also grab these chalk chalkboard tags six piece set and was just super excited when my store finally got these in and started stocking them and I was like I can make something really cute with these so definitely grab those and they have the uh, twine or jute if you will on the back to hang them from so there you go and they do also have little holes right here but if you wanted to you could cut that off or fill that in so many things you could do with these you guys know I don't need to tell you crafty people so also what I just found yesterday is this he makes all things new shadow box how beautiful and stunning is that he makes all things new amen he certainly does it's a shadow box so you could definitely DIY this it's absolutely beautiful and I'll probably leave it the way it is especially during Easter but also import and import it by Greenbrier so there's that one and just a few more things and we'll, we will be done I have passed these so many times I saw them last year skip them but I thought how cute would that be to do a DIY and with that being said that is why I grabbed this it's a four by six photo frame but as you can see here I mean it's like a shadow box you guys I kind of wish I had picked up two now but hopefully I will see them again and until I make something I only needed one so there's that and then also just ran across these yesterday how stunning and beautiful are these it is just a piece of wood but it has this metal piece on the front that says home sweet home and with the beautiful birds just reminds me of spring and I am super ready for that to happen and catch me by the sea look at that that is absolutely stunning perfect for a bathroom or to DIY and like I said this part is metal so I'm sure you could pop that right off and do your own take and use this in another DIY or you could use Google on and get these letters off and do your own take if you have a Cricut or use the rub on transfers so how cool are these so also grab this one as well the so water and weight or not and weight so water weight and it has the pitchfork shovel everything about gardening and several of my YouTube friends came to mind like Ernie Hatmaker and if you haven't seen her I'll link her below in the description box as well if you see these Ernie you need one <laughs> so definitely thought of you girl when I saw this one but how stinking cute are all three of these so too hard to hold all three of them at once but I will give it a go so there are those too stinking cute but thank you for watching I appreciate each and every one of you I know this was a long haul so I hope that you enjoyed watching and if you stayed to the end thank you so much 
And with all that being said, I hope you have a beautiful and blessed day. And until the next time, I will see you then. Have a good one.